Hey guys, hope you get what you are looking for. Let's see the business model of the company before getting into its financials. Do you know who is the manufacturer of fast food items packaging for burgers, french fries, and oily food products? It is expected the quick service restaurants to grow at a CAGR of over 18% for the next five years according to the business wire. Putum Z Papers They are leading manufacturer of specialty papers. Putum Z Papers along with fast grades they also manufacture tissues, pharma grades, baker grades, specialties grades, and writing printing grades. Putum Z Papers was established in 1964 in CUNY. Over the decade, they have continuously expanded their product offering through a wide range of special papers and soft tissues. Today, the company has an installed capacity of over 60,000 tons per annum. They have the potential to produce a wide range of products from 17 GSM to 100 GSM basis weight, with an ability to go even higher. Asia is the highest paper consumption continent and the consumption is expected to reach more than 300 million metric tons by 2030. Putum Z Papers are certified from U.S. Foods and Drugs Administration, International Organization for Standardization, FSC. FSC stands for Forest Stewardship Council. They are designed to create responsible practices that protect the world's forests. Putum Z Papers, one part of the revenue is also from hygiene products. Their major brands are Greenlime, Bazilvra, Ecoline Plus and lush in the hygiene sectors. Today, Greenlime has become synonymous with hygiene solutions in India. Their products adorn the shelves of the most prestigious stores in India like Big Bazaar, Spencer's, Nilgiris, Star Bazaar, Metro Cash and Carry to name a few, and their Colin Plus products are consumed by top corporate IT companies like Infosys, Nokia, TCS, Orchid etc. They are committed to the cause of a clean India mission. The campaign, which was officially launched on the 2nd of October 2014 at Rajgat, New Delhi by Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi, and also due to COVID-19, it is expected that the usage of hygiene products among us would become a part of our lives, in turn, would generate a large amount of revenue for Putumg Hygiene Solutions. Let's understand financials. Let's see financials of the Putum G paper with the help of Screener. Putum Z paper is a small cap company with market cap of 331 crore. It is trading around 34.9 rupees with 36.4 rupees as 52 week high and 12.5 rupees as 52 week low. Putum Z paper P is 6.58. Any stock with P below 15 is considered as cheap. Dividend yield between 4 to 6 percentage is said to be good. Putum's paper's dividend yield is 0.57 percent. Not great numbers. Return on capital employed and return on equity looks good with 19.2 percent and 17.0 percent with face value 1. One year graph looks promising. Some pros and cons are company is almost debt free and con is Company has a low return on equity of 11.58% for last three years. Putum Z paper when compared with its peer, it has low P of 6.58. Highest year on year quarterly profit growth percent of 445.64 and second highest ROC percent after West Coast paper. Sales remains almost constant. Operating profit increase from 10 to 26 crore and net profit increase from 5 to 21 on quarterly results. To get a better picture, let's see year-on-year -year results. Sales raised from 469 to 604 crore until 2020. Due to COVID, there is a drop in sales in 2021. There is a significant linear growth in operating profit and net profit over the years from 27 to 68 crores and 13 to 35 crores, and also we can see earning per share has increased from 0.20 to 3.16 rupees. Compounded sales growth is minus 1% for last 5 years, and compounded profit growth is 39% for last 5 years. Borrowings has been reduced from 114 to 18 crores, 
but total liabilities has increased from 430 to 548 crore. Cash flow, maximum revenue comes from operating activity in 2021. ROC percent has increased from 10 to 19 percent in last three years. Promoters have increased their shareholding form last three quarter, that is a positive thing. Putin's paper stock price has risen by more than 60% in last one month. Thank you for making up to the end. Hope you learned something useful out of this video. Stay safe.